Please read the disclaimer. Welcome! I'm Bio, and today I'm playing Super Speed Machines. And yes, I know, I realize the music is not grand. Sometimes this happens with the DS emulator. So, this game was released in Japan as Simple DS Series Volume 13. Ijo Kisho Wo Supashiya. The Arashi no Drift Rally. Something like that. And surprisingly, it was released in, Euro in, in Europe and US as... Well, it's not surprisingly. It was released in Europe and US as Super Speed Machines. And surprisingly, it was released in Australia as Top Gear Downforce for some reason. I don't know why. So they decided to link it with Top Gear. Hmm. Not a clue. Anyway... I don't really know what to expect with this game. It's a racing game at the end of the day. I don't really know what to expect. Hopefully it's interesting. So let's jump right into the old single player. We'll do a Grand Prix, why not? Um, we only can pick the first one anyway. Oh, so we have a like, little, like, car... Little, oh, okay, so we have, like, little squash-together cars. So we've got Rally, 4x4, Sports, Muscle, Custom... Oh, okay. And classic. Let's do Custom. Custom looks interesting. Firestorm. So, I guess we're ready to race. Let's go. Okay. Select hazard. Lightning or clouds. Lightning cloud, I guess. There's a mini map. Select location. Oh. Yeah, I guess. Select lap. Okay, I think that's it, okay. We're going. Now off we go. Oh, so it's like micro machines. Oh, okay, the controls are not grand. <laughs> so yeah, it's like micro machines. It's okay, I think. Well, the controls could really do better. Very, the turning's very floaty. Very floaty. That's the, that's the reason why I'm having issues. Oh god. Like I just turn and he just he decides to float all over the place. It's not nice. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. This I don't like this. I don't like this at all. The, the, the controls are so far. Oh, just where? What am I stuck on? I don't even know what I'm stuck on. Can I reverse? Yeah, I can. Okay. Well, I'm not going to win this race. 100%. Oh. I'm not paying attention to the mini map, by the by, by, my mind you. So. Yeah. So this doesn't play well. It's the turning. The turning is the real deciding factor. It's also the, the courses are not very well done. Oh, well, we just don't have fucking... What I'm trying to say is, right, I'm driving along here. Now, it's a bit different when your perspective is behind, like third person, not top-down view. But don't have a game where you, you're driving around this, you're following the track, no problem, okay, whatever. Right, not like that, but... The point I'm trying to make is, like, the, the road splits sometimes, but you can only go one direction, so... And you can easily just end up smashing into the wall, like here. Oh! Oh, that's not the way I wanted to go. Simply be yeah, simply because you don't know... You, <laughs> you can't see what's up ahead. And yeah, you can look down to the minimap fine, but uh, at the same time... It's not great. It doesn't also help that the controls are really floaty. They're so, so floaty. Like, I, I'm i literally having to press the D-pad left and right constantly just to straighten my car... I've done it again. Just to straighten my car back up. That's literally it. Like, I'm having to press for right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, like that to just straighten my car up. It's not a good sign. It really is not a good sign. Not a good sign of a good racing game. Yeah, I, I'm, I don't like this game. Just simply on the turning alone, the turning kind of just ruins it. So, 
Yeah, disappointing, really. Get stuck there. We get trapped with my own trap. Brilliant! Yeah, just fucking like that. Get a boost. Everyone else has already finished the race, you know. So, uh, yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing grandiosa here. Mm, amazing. Oh, yep, smash into that again. That's what I mean. That the, this, the turning is so floaty. It just slide. You slide all over the place. It's just so fucking shite. All right, I forgot to mention. I don't know if I mentioned this game is developed by Chemco, and it was published by Majesco in. America, at least. I think I forgot to mention that at the beginning. But uh, yeah, I'm not going to play any. I'm not going to play another race simply because it's just I've, I've, my my thoughts and feelings on this game are already solidified. It, the turning is horrible. The turning really could be improved upon. It's so floaty. Like y you just tap the D-pad and your you, you car, little car, just goes all over the place. It's just fucking stupid. Um, the top-down view is fine, but the controls need to be tight. You can't have controls like that. They've got to be real tight to have a top-down view. Uh, I would say, personally, you would have been better off going for... You know, you could have controls that are floaty, but it's all depending on where the camera is, so... It allows you to react in time. I don't know. But yeah, Super Speeds Machines. I did not enjoy this game, so... Uh, happy Bio. Thanks for watching. We've got one more simple DS series game to look at for this time around final English released game and that'll be it. So, see you next time.